and welcome back to the Real Estate News. For a long time, controlling your smart home meant you had to unlock your phone, open an app, select a specific device, and then press a button to control things, from the lights to the security system. Not with technologies like voice control that we have now, managing your smart home can be rather simple. We are so excited, joining us from New York live with how we can make our own homes a little smarter and our lives at home a little easier is tech expert and TV personality, Katie Linendahl. Good morning, Katie, how are you today? Good morning, thanks for having me, appreciate it. Absolutely, thank you so much for joining us. We're so excited to have you. Okay, let's learn some things about smart homes and tech. So what are some of your favorite new trends when it comes to smart home technology, Katie? Yes, well, I think you know, smart home is this thing we keep hearing a lot more and more about and get used to it because it's only growing in popularity week over week, month over month, year over year. And one of my favorite trends happening right now in the world of smart homes is definitely voice. And say hello to Alexa, because sitting right in front of me is Alexa, which is Amazon's voice assistant technology for the smart home. And what you can do is actually be able to connect with and control all the devices in your house from the lighting to the fan to the coffee pot all with your voice as you noted so it's really neat in terms of being able to showcase how simple and how easy it is because tech savvy or not all you have to do is use that operative word alexa turn on the light and automatically the lights go right on and what's really cool about this is it can be as much or as little as you want you can connect a smart switch that has a smart fan attached to it, a smart lamp, or you can get really crazy in my direction and you can actually add things like a smart vacuum cleaner, which using that operative word, you would say, Alexa, tell the vacuum cleaner to actually clean the living room. No problem, work is done. If you can make your life easier and more simpler using voice control, that is a trend that I am all on for. Wow, Katie, that is just amazing. And Alexa, that's also amazing. I've heard Alexa can go so far as control your music in your home too, is that correct? Well, that's the cool part about it. So I've actually showcased, as you just saw there, you know, briefly, a number of gadgets that you can actually tie with Alexa. But it, there's so many different options, and as they like to call them, skills that you can add into the device. So using Echo Dot or the Echo, as you're seeing right in front of me, you can actually ask it for the weather. Is it gonna rain today? What is the capital of Alaska? What is the capital of Pennsylvania? You can ask it trivia questions, you can ask it fun questions where's the closest farmers market what's the traffic like sports scores did the Celtics win last night all through just the device without having to add on anything in general so what was cool too is like growing up you know we didn't have that kind of technology where you get instant answers on demand all again through either the echo or the echo dot wow that's amazing so Alexa can help you out with education, intelligence, uh, ways to get your home in better shape. And does she also help with outside the home? You mentioned that you can find out the weather, but does she control things or have access to some smart technologies outside the home as well? One of the things that I love is the shopping aspect. If you don't wanna to have to head out to the mall, especially if you're in a busy time of year where it's very popular, you can actually order devices or order technologies or gadgets or gifts, whatever you want, right through the device. And of course, for that added security, if you wanna add a pin before anything is purchased, you can do that as well. Or perhaps you're like cooking a dinner and you, you're missing an ingredient, you can actually say, Alexa, reorder olive oil and it will be brought to your door, you know, just like Amazon, you know how it works super fast. So awesome technologies and a number of different skills more, more being added every single week i always look for the emails to see what companies actually have on board and adding their skills in there so it's really cool to be able to yes work inside the home and also out wow that is absolutely amazing so much new stuff now for those of us that may not be super high techie quote unquote do you have any tips for us for getting kind of into this place where we can do some of this stuff in our home yeah, I think the smart home can be, you know, it sounds intimidating and it sounds very Jetsons-esque, but I think one of the things that's really cool about it now is, you know, it's so attainable. In the past, it would be thousands and tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands of dollars to actually make your home a smart home. But now when you have gadgets under $60 that actually you can be able to voice command through, that's where it gets really cool. But I also tell people, you know, start with baby steps. If you are a little intimidated by technology, maybe ask about the weather or ask for uh, a news flash and ask what the the news updates are for the day and then maybe you graduate to something like a smart switch that you can plug a lamp into or um, smart LED lighting or a coffee maker that you can turn on and off so you can definitely grow and, and, and add more things as you like but that's also the nice part about it is it's a la carte so you can add and, and remove as you please and as you're desired. Well that's so helpful because like you said that kind of technology can seem very intimidating and um, 
you want to be able to know that you can access it, like you said, baby steps or bit by bit. So that's really helpful information. Thank you so much. And then a couple more questions quickly. We're running out of time a little, but um, you mentioned security now that Alexa can and work with you with a smart home. Is there other ways that Alexa can help or that this smart home technology can help with security for your home and peace of mind? Well, I definitely, uh, you know, consumers and rightfully so, it's a, probably the biggest question that comes with is the security and encryption and is the device always listening? All great questions. You know, this is all under the Amazon umbrella and it has to go through any of these gadgets that I discussed today under Alexa have to go through an Alexa certification program so they are rigorously tested but also people should know that the device is only listening when you say that operative word which is Alexa and Alexa can actually be switched to computer or echo if you might have a kid named Alexa which is a question I've been asked before um, but also you can create pin codes when you are shopping or when you are checking things like your bank statement or when your what your balance is you can add things like pin codes and you can always mute the device so there are are some little extra precautions that people enjoy, uh, myself included, that make you feel a little bit more secure, but do know that everything is under an Amazon umbrella and the utmost importance to them is security and also privacy. Fantastic, and I suppose we can go to Amazon.com for more information. Thank you, Katie Linendahl, uh, TV personality and tech expert for joining.